Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm filming a video that I've not filmed ever. Like this is the first time I've ever filmed this kind of video. I am gonna be decluttering my wardrobe. As you'll have probably noticed on my channel, I've got so many hauls and I buy a lot of clothes. I'm also lucky enough to get gifted quite a lot of clothes and I've just somehow accumulated like three whole wardrobes full of clothes. I have got this one right here in this room. I've also got the ones in my bedroom and then I've also got two full chest of drawers. So I've managed to accumulate a lot of clothes. So it's about time I had a decluttering guys it's about time I got rid of some shit that I don't wear yeah it just needs to happen it needs to happen and I thought why not film it why not share with you guys my little declutter journey fun little fact for you about today's video all these clothes are probably gonna be from the last two years because two years ago is when I started my job which obviously I got money from which is when I started going out and buying my own clothes and stuff so yeah everything that I'm gonna have bought is technically I mean in the grand scheme of things it's technically new isn't it because it's in the past two years get ready for a big declutter guys if you do enjoy today's video be sure to give it a big thumbs up let me know in the comments if you enjoy this kind of video let's get started I don't even know where to start guys so this is the current situation i'm actually in the spare room so you probably don't recognize this room at all because it's our spare one but this is basically a pile of denim stuff that i have um oh my god you see these have even got the tag in i actually got sent these not so long ago so that's probably why they've got the tag in but yeah some of these clothes will probably have the tag in because i've never worn them that's how bad i am but look at all these clothes guys it's ridiculous the pile goes on and on and on i'm hoping to feel a lot better and refreshed after i've had a clear out whether i'm actually gonna or not i've got no idea wish me luck my loves I'm just gonna get started. So a lot of these clothes that I'm gonna be showing you are summer clothes because this is kind of like a summer wardrobe for me. I kind of just tend to keep all my summery clothes in here. So there is gonna be like a little bit of a mix of winter jumpers and stuff, but on the whole, it's gonna be quite uh, summer orientated. So yeah. Okay, I'm gonna untuck my top. I'm gonna get ready. Um, I'm gonna start with the denim pile because I feel like this is a good place to start. So. This pair of denim jeans, which I obviously got sent quite recently, which you probably will recognise. I'm obviously going to keep those. I should probably take the tag out. So my keep pile is going to be towards this side of the bed. And then my charity pile is probably going to be towards the back. And then anything that I'm going to chuck is going to go this way. So that's kind of how the video is going to go. These are some mom jeans from Pull and Bear. They're keeping because I love them. I'm so tempted to sort out all of my clothes into actual proper outfits, you know, like have them in my wardrobe as I'd wear them. So I feel like I might do that afterwards. Okay, I feel like this video could take a very long time if I'm just going to show you every single item. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to time lapse it up. I'm going to hopefully show you a lot of the clothes. I'm just going to hold them up like that and then you can see like where I'm going to put them. So if I'm going to keep them again, this way, charity towards the like that side of the room and then anything that I'm going to chuck is going to go this way so yeah you kind of know what's going on I'm going to time lapse it up I hope you enjoy this little time lapse um so yeah let's go I'm going to put some music on to make me feel like inspired right let the music blast out let's declutter wish me luck one two three fuck it guys i got all my denim sorted yay i've just put them there how the wardrobe looks by the way it's quite a small one and then you open it up and then it's got some like chest of drawers down here um that's got some storage for our like uh blankets and stuff like that so i've used that to put all of my denim on and then here is the wardrobe space so there's not a lot of space for this many clothes like how they've all been fitting in there is literally like, i don't even get it i literally don't so i'm gonna keep decluttering proud of myself for doing the denim to be honest I've not chucked anything away yet uh, i liked all of the jeans and they all fit so it's not going that well to be honest i actually got out uh, oh this is bad lighting isn't it that was a bad idea i actually got out the charity bag looks like this so anything that i am going to be donating um, i just wanted to put it at the back of the room so i'm just going to put it here and then anything that i do want to donate to charity i'm going to put it at the back there 
feeling motivated. I'm going to keep listening to Florence and the Machine because she's genuinely giving me such enthusiasm for this clearing out. Let's continue guys, let's continue. Okay guys, so I actually have sorted out this wardrobe into summer clothes. So I figured that a lot of the clothes in this tiny little wardrobe were actually winter clothes. So I've put them all there, like all the big woolly jumpers and like the long trousers and stuff. So everything in here is, apart from this end stuff actually, because that is my mum's, but here is kind of like summer clothes. So they're all like little blouses and culottes and things like that. So that is kind of summery and obviously the wardrobe is not full. So with all this stuff, I figured it would be a good idea to actually get cracking with my bedroom. So in my bedroom, I have got like quite a hefty set of wardrobes, which look like this. So there's actually three, one, two, three wardrobes and they're all jam packed full of clothes. And I've got such a mix of like summer clothes, winter clothes, going out clothes, chilling at home clothes. Like I need to sort them out into kind of like categories because when I'm waking up in the morning and trying to pick my outfit for work, I am genuinely like baffled as to where all of my clothes are actually like where are they i'm just i just like wake up and i'm like where are my clothes so i'm gonna kind of sort them out and this is gonna be predominantly like autumn and winter clothes because i have got more of those clothes to be honest yeah i'm gonna get cracking with this room so cue another time lapse of me emptying this wardrobe um oh my god i feel like this is gonna take me a long time <laughs> I have got so many like going out things that I've just never worn. Like this, look at this gorgeous dress. It's halter neck, it's from Topshop. It's just so beautiful and I've literally never worn it because I've never had like chance to wear it, I guess. I'm gonna obviously keep it because I feel like it's gorgeous and I potentially would wear it at some point. But how beautiful is that? So I'm gonna put all my going out clothes. Well, I feel like this maybe should be my going out wardrobe just because I have got storage stuff at the bottom of each wardrobe and this storage stuff is quite low. So I feel like for my longer dresses and stuff, this one will be better. So I'm gonna take all these clothes out. Now I know for a fact that all of these clothes in this wardrobe are jumpers, big coats, things like that, like very, very wintry. So I don't know whether it'd be a bad idea to get all those out now. Yeah, I feel like I'm gonna work my way through my other stuff. So I'm gonna sort out all of my going out clothes. Look at the state of my room, it's such a mess, but oh my gosh, look at that. I wore that for my 18th when I went out and uh, safe to say I probably will never wear that again. It's a cute little bodysuit. I remember wearing that actually. The night I wore that actually, I went out um, into Newcastle for like a night out, which I just like already, you probably, if you know me well, like if you've watched my videos for a long time, probably like, what? Like you went out into Newcastle and that, yeah, I did do that. And uh, that night when I wore this little bad boy, I actually decked it on the dance floor and face planted and I had knee high boots on with a heel and I fully went just flat down on my face. Like I was almost as if I died on, on the dance floor and uh, not actually properly being out since, as in like out, out, so. That was the story of that one. That is so cute. I actually love that. Keeping it, keeping it, keeping it. So as I've been going through all my clothes, it's been quite funny actually going through all of my clothes because every item of clothing has like a memory attached to it. And I wanted to share this one because this is the top that I actually wore on my first ever date with Ben. It's just this normal kind of like blue and white stripy top and it's got flared sleeves and it's actually from Primark. 
I just cannot believe I wore this on my first day. I don't actually have any photos of me on my first date with them, but I remember, I remember exactly what I wore. It was this. I wore some black culottes and I wore a very, very bright yellow leather jacket. <laughs> yeah, I just thought it'd be interesting to share that with you guys because, I mean, if you wanted any first date inspiration, I probably wouldn't recommend what I wore because looking back, I was like, I don't know, like I wouldn't wear that again for a first day, I don't think, but I mean, it works because I'm still with Ben, so kudos to me, kudos to me. I'm definitely gonna keep it. I'm probably gonna keep that top forever. <laughs> okay guys, so here are all my going out clothes. I put, this pile is going out as in like maybe to an event or like nice clothes, if you know what I mean. This pile is a mixture of winter and summer clothes because I'm gonna sort them out with the ones next door. The next wardrobe I'm gonna tackle is this one. So as I said, like this one is kind of full of wintery jumpers and stuff. Like it's got my leather jacket in. I appreciate that's not actually for winter, but. Uh, I don't know why that's in there. But yeah, it's got like big woolly jumpers and my hoodies and stuff like that. So I feel like this one's going to be pretty easy to sort out because I know if I wear them or not. And if I don't wear them, I can just chuck them away. It's not a case of whether I like them or not because hoodies are hoodies, you know. Hoodie is a hoodie. Okay, wish me luck. Let's go. jacket that I wore for my date with Ben. I'm not gonna lie, I'm feeling really tired. I've been doing this for like an hour already and I just feel like I've been a little lie down, you know? I've got piles bloody everywhere. Look, pile, pile, pile. Well, that's a pile of hangers. I've also found some of Ben's shirts in my wardrobe, which I didn't even realize that I had in my wardrobe, so that's great. Thanks, Ben. I've got this one left to tackle, which is the biggest one. <laughs> oh, laddie, I can't cope no longer. The thing is about this wardrobe, it's got such a range of clothes. Like I've got all sorts of shit in here. So, oh God, I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna get it all out. Once I've got it out, I don't have a choice but to put it back in the, some kind of wardrobe. So I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna go for it. Oh my god, help, help, help. Okay, so we're about half an hour in. Um, I can't stop blowing my nose because of all like the dust because I've literally cleared out my wardrobe. So that's why I look a little bit, a little bit rough. So this is where we're at with the current um, larger wardrobe situation. Um, so I've started here with longer trousers and I've got some dungarees there as well. So like longer bottom half items. And then here I've got more like thin jumpers and some tops as well. And then I'm moving up onto thicker, warmer jumpers. And then right at the back, I've got like my Christmas jumpers. And this is a dress that I can't really see myself wearing that often. So I wanted to put stuff that I wouldn't really wear closer to the back. Um, and then obviously as you get to the front like easily accessible stuff is the stuff that I'm gonna wear the most so I've still got all this to go um it's still looking quite messy in my room I've got stuff everywhere but I don't know I feel like I'm doing quite well I have also finished this wardrobe this has got all of my jackets all of my winter jackets so I've got like blazers and my like my leather jackets and stuff and then here is all thicker like chilled jumpers like this one and then I've got some hoodies as well which are in the middle and then this is like kind of a thermal jumper that I've got as well so I thought I'd put that in there that wardrobe is also done and then I also finished this wardrobe which looks a little bit crammed at the moment but I've literally shoved everything in here so I've got a mixture of blouses like quite nice blouses that I'd go out in and then I've got like shorter dresses and some skirts in here as well then I've got this kind of stuff which is more event like for the races or for a wedding or something so I've got that then there and then here because I didn't have anywhere else to put them I've just got some of my longer like midi skirts as well so yeah it's going quite well um two wardrobes down I've I've got this one left to go. I also finished this wardrobe as well. So this is looking a little bit crammed, just like the others. It's actually very, very organized. I feel like I know what's going on here. So here I started with like longer culotte trousers. This is all like summer clothes, by the way. So all of this is kind of what I'd be wearing right now, this time of year. So 
I've got like jumpsuits in here and then some skirts, all like bottom half things. And then in the middle, I've got some pinafores as well. I've got a little dress and then I've got more blouses and shirts up here that I could match with the like collots and the jumpsuits and stuff like that. So it, although it looks kind of unorganized, to me, it's actually it's actually pretty organized. I feel, feel a little bit proud of myself. For the charity bag, it's not that full to be honest. This is what it's currently looking like. So there's not that much stuff in it, but I've not actually filled it up with everything yet. I've just put half of the stuff in there. It's going pretty well. Just thought I'd check in and chat to you guys. The time is now currently quarter past 12. So I I mean, I'm hoping to get everything done by like one o'clock. It's actually quite hard work is this. This encourages any of you guys to actually have a clear out, which I kind of hope it does. Like I really want to send out that message in this video that it's okay to buy clothes. Like we live in a world where fashion is just constantly changing and it's okay to buy new clothes. I think it's just keeping organized with it and trying not to forget what you have so then you don't duplicate and buy again. So there's nothing in my wardrobe that I've discovered so far that's the same. Every item is different. Yeah, doing good, doing good, feeling positive. Gonna keep going and sorting out this big ass wardrobe. Okay you guys, as you can see I've got a change of outfit on. That's because I've been trying a few bits on that I didn't know if they would fit me or if they would suit me still. Um, but I just thought I'd show you this one because this is the one that I've currently got on. It's actually a wrap dress and it's from Zaffle. It's actually quite old now but it's um, super cute and I really really like it so I'm gonna keep it. So I literally just need to put this into my wardrobe and then I'm completely done. I am so so proud of myself for actually getting through it. The current time is 1 p.m. and I've actually managed to have some lunch as well so I bet I was done at like quarter to one or something. Yeah it did not take too long. I literally think it took about two hours to like literally clear out four wardrobes which is not that bad. Um, I feel so much more organized than everything. Um, I would seriously urge anybody who is watching this video who's thinking like mm, maybe my wardrobe's a little bit messy and um, I would seriously urge you to go for it and just clear it out because it feels so good it feels so good so if you did enjoy today's video be sure to give it a big thumbs up let me know in the comments if you like this kind of video because I've got a lot of chests of drawers including these these and I've got some next door and then in the room after I've got like five sets of chests of drawers that are also quite full of shit that I need to clear out not just of clothes but other, other things like beauty and all different kinds of things so if you like this kind of like cleaning video clearing out be sure to let me know so then I can do more of them yeah I hope you all have a fabulous week, whatever you get up to, and I will see you again next week for another video. Bye guys!